So big shout out to everyone that has supported my channel, really do appreciate it. If you guys are new, definitely this is a place that will save you money, cut the cord, and a lot of different things that I do on this channel, including tech reviews, Cody overviews, uh, bills, APKs, different ways to get your content. So definitely subscribe if you haven't done so already. Also big shout out to iPassport for sponsoring this giveaway. Uh, make sure you stay tuned, watch the entire video for the giveaway details. So before we take a look at the keyboard and do the unboxing and the setup, just wanted to uh, tell you guys that I will be giving giving away all 20 of them and what I'll do is I'll do two giveaways 10 a piece and uh, I will be doing one next Monday and one on Wednesday so stay tuned for that I'll split it up and make sure you watch the entire video make sure you follow all the instructions and good luck to everyone so let's go over to Amazon we'll take a look at the pricing all right so it is $11.99 for the US version and do have a Canadian version as well as a version for the UK and I will be putting links to all three in the description of this video so you do have some color options here guys so you do have the black one which i will be giving away you also have the white you also have a gold version and you do have a rose gold version as well so um same same thing on all three of them the color is just a little bit different and of course this is for your android box can work on your pc works on your raspberry pi as well and uh, it does work on your amazon fire tv third generation as well as your fire stick but you will need an otg cable and i'll show you guys the otg cable a little bit later in the setup so let's go ahead and jump into the unboxing all right so here's the keyboard on the front it says i passport mini keyboard 2.4 gigahertz Nothing on the back. Let's go ahead and open it. All right. So it looks like we do have a uh, mini keyboard instructions. And this is actually worth taking a look, guys. This will give you the different button combinations that will do certain things. For instance, the function in F2 will activate the black light LED function. So definitely worth taking a look. It's only a couple pages. So if you're going to use this thing, you might as well use it properly. All right. Also comes with a USB charger. And I've seen these on a lot of um, different keyboards before, guys. And basically how this works is that this will plug into your device. Then this uh, gives you like a, a the USB port back so you can use this to do something else. Um, not taken away from the device that you plugged into. And this will actually charge your keyboard. Introduction. Specs. So um, worth taking a look again, guys. So it tells you what it's um, compatible with. The feature specifications so tells you the dimension power supply rechargeable battery so here we are feels pretty good in my hands up top right there you have the on and off button you have the charging port up top you do have your volume up volume down rewind fast forward play pause and get a closer look you do have the home Looks like you have the stop mute you have the keyboard this look like it's the right click you have the left click here menu search back and this is just your navigation order to move up and down. You have the function F8 that actually turns on the click function. All right, so a lot of different options, function and um, page up to actually go home uh, function and enter that will activate your alt control and delete. Let's open it up. All right, so here's the dongle. This is what you'll plug into your device. So it gives you some information on the battery and this is also listed in the actual booklet that we took a look at earlier and we're going to power it on for the first time and it does come with some battery guys all right so every time you press a button you'll see that blue light comes on if you hit function in this you can see it turns a different color there pretty cool it's for the led all right, so hard to see. I'll turn the light off in a little bit just so you can take a look at it. But before we jump into that, I just wanted to show you guys with the Fire Stick what I'm using. Uh, Fire Stick and Fire TV third generation, guys, you want an OTG cable like this one. And basically what this does is this will allow you to add USB ports to your device. So what you do is use this port right here. This is your power supply. So plug it in. All right. Now when you Fire TV or Fire Stick, what you do is just plug this in and this will actually power the device like so and then the beauty of this is now you have two more ports guys so here's your keyboard for the ipass port here's a usb stick and for everyone that likes a wired connection 
Here's an Ethernet to USB adapter that works well with your Fire Stick and your Fire TV third generation. So definitely I'll put links to these in the description as well guys. But if you're going to use this on a Fire TV third generation or a Fire Stick, you're going to need an OTG cable, okay? And so here's just a little look at the lights um, in the dark. It looks pretty good, right? Some light shining from the left. So you can see it illuminates pretty good. It illuminates when you press a button. And to turn it off, of course, you hit the function and you also hit the F2. And it can go away and now you can um, press and it won't come on. Uh, press it again. And you can see the light comes back on. And it looks really good, guys. I put a link in the description of this video where you can pick it up. I'll put three links. Uh, one for UK, USA, and Canada. And uh, if you guys don't win, of course, uh, definitely worth the buy. It's only $11 um, when you pick it up on Amazon. So in order to be eligible to win this device, you have to do three things. First thing, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure your notification bell is checked. Second thing, make sure you hit that thumbs up at the bottom of this video. It's under the play window. Third and most important, guys, you need to share this video on social media. And how a winner will be picked is that when you share this video, drop a link to your social media where you share this video and that's how the randomizer will pick a winner if you guys have any questions about the giveaway just let me know like i said three things make sure you subscribe to the channel with the notification bells checked two make sure you hit that thumbs up at the bottom of this video and three make sure you share on social media and drop a link where you shared this video so that's it for this video if you guys have any questions let me know please remember to like share and subscribe and i'll catch you on the next one